Hi, welcome to my crazy life. I'm Lori. Welcome back. Welcome new viewers. Today I have a Target haul. A little couponing, a little spring, a little shopping. Um, yeah, so subscribe, like, hit the bell, and let's get moving. Okay, today I went to Target on a mission. I needed razors. I didn't get the razors I wanted, but I got some razors. Um, there was a deal. Um, the Chic, if you bought two packages of the Quattro for the women or the men, I think it was any of those are several of the Chic, um, buy two, get a $5 gift card. That is also part of a spend 20, get a $5 gift card. So I bought four of this men's because they were out of the women's. And these are perfect to donate to, like, I'm thinking the Veterans Center. So I got four packs of the men's. They were $5.99. I had a $3 coupon. Made them $2.99. Um, for each two, I got $5 back. And $2 I bought them. Good deal. So I bought four. So ten, I got two $5 gift cards. Plus a five dollar gift card for spending twenty dollars, so uh, they paid me about seven or eight dollars to bring these home. I will do the deal again once I went to two Targets, and I saw some talking to some ladies at the second Target, and she said that they were completely out, but the next shipment or the next truck comes in Tuesday, so Tuesday or Wednesday after work, I'll stop on my way home and see if I can grab the ladies because that's what I will use and my niece will use. So. Um, I bought that. Also, in the same transaction, there was spend 20 on kitty litter, get a $5 gift card. Um, I feel like I got four or $5 gift cards on that transaction, and I don't know how that happened. But let's look. Um, so I got a lot of $5 gift cards. I got one two and a ten. Oh yeah so when i got the kitty let's see the kitty litter was spend 20 give a on tidy cats get a five dollar gift card so i bought a big tub of the clumping and a bag of the not clumping so that came to like twenty dollars and 96 cents and i got a five dollar gift card back necessities in life so during for that transaction i bought the four razors the two um Kitty litters, something else. Um, kitty litter, kitty litter. Oh, and I bought also at that store these pens. Well, not pens. They're highlighter on the top and marker on the bottom. So this is yellow and pink highlighter, and then pink and black marker on the bottom. Which I thought was awesome for a dollar. I'm always needing highlighters. So I grabbed those. And I bought these, which I originally thought were for me. However, I just found out that Sarah bought a house, her first house. I'm so proud of her. So I'm putting together a cleaning um, household bucket. So I got her these for her bucket. So I'll take those to her. So that total out of pocket for me was... $31.89. I did use a $5 gift card. I got a $1.42 discount on my for my red card, but then I got $20 back in gift cards. So in essence, I just paid $16. So that's not bad. I mean, that was one bucket of kitty litter and I got all the rest of the stuff. So then I went to the second Target. <sighs> Sorry. And found a couple things there. First off, I got the bunny. Now, I know they had these last year. These were $3. I have the one that sits up, but I didn't have I couldn't find this one last year. So I was so excited to find this little guy. I love the simplicity of the white and the gold and they're super cute and you just put them on my dining room table. Perfect. So I have the one now that sits up and the little one here for $3. And then in that dollar spot, they had all of their St. Patrick's Day stuff, 50% off. So I grabbed Sarah and I some socks. 
I got these, which are gray and white stripe, but the green, they say Lucky Charm. That's for me. These are also for me, but quite frankly, I love green. I'll wear these all year round. They're just cute little striped socks. And then for Sarah, I got Kiss Me, I'm Lucky. St. Patrick's Day socks for her to wear to school. And these were 50 cents a pair. And they're good quality. I wear these all the time. I, I love, I love theme socks. I love Halloween socks and Christmas. Christmas socks, I have 25 pairs. So from December 1st until Christmas Day, I have a different pair of Christmas socks to wear every single day. So excited. So now I have, and I'm not, I have about three or four pair of Easter socks. So I need to start wearing those and then the St. Patrick's Day socks. So I got those. I bought also in the dollar spot, which is not a dollar. I think it's just $5. A hanging planter. And this was $5. Oh my God. And it is ceramic y, glassware heavy, empty. Pretty deep Ooh, with the hole in the bottom, which I need to fill with rocks. But what I think I'm going to do over my kitchen sink, I'm going to hang an extension rod, the kind that like our um, pressure in there, and hang this from it. Oh, it's kind of heavy, so maybe not. I might have to hang a hook somewhere. And I have, I'm actually um, starting a couple ivy plants that I had that I was cutting back. And so I think I'll put them in here, hang this, and let it go to town. So I just love this for spring, and I love flowers and plants in my house. I got that. And then what else did I get? I got this shirt, which I love. I'm not sure if you could see this color. It's red, white, and blue. I mean, it's and it's a long sleeve, button-up, flannel, lightweight, though. And it is completely red, white, and blue. I just bought a pair of navy, old navy pants in this blue. I'm, I mean, I'm thinking it's a slightly darker blue than this. But, I mean, I can wear this right now in the spring. I can wear this in the evenings with shorts and a t-shirt and just slip it on if it's a cool evening. In Ohio, we get cool nights in the summer. Or if I'm at the beach, or when I'm in Scotland. Because I totally feel like, yes, it's flannel, but this is spring-summer colors. This is red, white, and blue. So I'm going to wear that maybe to work tomorrow if I can get it laundered up. And then my last purchase from the Target spot, and I buy these all the time, um, it's just a black t-shirt, v-neck, women's. It's the Ava and Vive brand. 2X, Made in Haiti, I mean, it's whatever brand that is. And they're $8. Right now they're 3 for 20 but I have I have enough of these. I don't need a ton more. Um, but I'm making a shirt for Scotland. This is crazy and a little convoluted. However, from high school, literature class, the only line that I can readily remember from William Shakespeare's plays that we had to read was Out Damn Spot from Macbeth. I'm making a shirt that says Out Damn Spot for two reasons. One, that takes place in Scotland, and the play does. And we're going on a literary tour, and I want to wear it on the literary tour. Probably with, you know, maybe underneath that flannel shirt. I don't know, but, um, or jacket or cardigan or something. But I thought, how freaking appropriate. Out Damn Spot with some blood dripping off of it. Um twist it up here. There we go. Um, to wear when we take our literary tour, you know, literature and all that. So those were, let's see, the t-shirt was $8. The button-up shirt, which the brand is Universal Thread Company. And I've seen it. Oh, I've seen a few from this company before. This was $22.99. No deals on that. Um, the bunny was $3.00. The planter was five, and the socks were fifty cents a piece. So my total was forty three fifty three. Um, as much as I love a good deal, and trust me, I love a good deal. When it comes to clothing, in my size, and I'm not, I don't think I'm huge, but to my size, in order for me to 
five shirt. Now I always go up a size in Target type shirts like that. They don't have any stretch. So I wear generally a 2X. That's a 3. Um, and the pants I wear like at Old Navy 1618 at Lane Bryant, like a 1416. It really just depends on the brand. But um, if I find it, I buy it. I will save money everywhere else in my life, but when it comes to dressing and clothes and work and having things that are appropriate and fit appropriately, if I see it, I'm buying it because that's just, I know when I go back, they're not going to have it. Um, especially Target, they don't tend to restock a lot. And the same thing with Old Navy. Um, I've got a bunch of Old Navy stuff coming in the mail, so we'll do a haul, maybe a try on when that gets here. But for now, that was my small and mighty little Target haul from two stores. I need to go back and get the rest of the razors. I want to get the four packages of the ladies chic on that. So yeah, so have a great week and I'll talk to you later. Bye.